Today we're talking about collections and how they affect you buying a home. Collections are a very sensitive topic to lenders. Number one, collections, regardless of if they're valid or not, once it hits your credit report, your credit will take a nosedive. If you've had a collection hit in the last two to six months from when you pull credit for a mortgage, you're probably about 100 points down, literally. It, the collection can be $10 or the collection can be a million dollars. That's an exaggeration I've never seen. Actually, once I saw a million dollar collection, it was a judgment. But anyway, the point is, it's the, the act of the derogatory that makes your credit go down, not the amount. The amount doesn't matter. It's the fact that you ignored a bill according to the credit algorithm. It just thinks you've ignored a bill and it thinks that you're gonna ignore the mortgage too. So whether that's true or not, that's how it is. So any collection, medical, anything, any kind of collection. So that being said, if the collection is charged off, then we don't pay attention to it. It's been charged off. But if it's in collection status, it has the potential to possibly be repaid. So at qualification, we, any collections that are cumulative, if you have cumulative collections over $2,000 uh, that are non-medical, so medical we can discount, but the 2,000 aggregate of non-medical collections, then we have to take a potential 5% repayment. Whether or not you're in repayment, we're not going to make you go and repay anything. However, we have to, in your debt to income ratio for your monthly debts, we have to assume a 5% payment. So that means that if you have $10,000 in cumulative collections, we have to take a $500 a month payment assuming that at some point you're going to pay those back. And your credit score has to be okay enough to get everything through. Again, collections are a really funny thing because sometimes they're there and they shouldn't be. We get it. Sometimes they're old and collection companies sell to new collection companies and they keep getting renewed. We get it. So get some help. There's some companies out there. If you need any recommendations, let us know. Go to some of the bureaus and get some, you know, write to the bureaus and say this is not valid. Get your credit cleaned up. However, don't think that just because you have collections you can't get a loan. That's not true. You can. We just have to maneuver between the payment, payback, 5% rule, and whether it's charged off or not, and of course what your credit score is at the end of the day after the collections are, are factored in. Okay? Comment here. Ask me. Reach out to me if you have any questions. Good luck on your home search, and I'll talk to you soon.